Hey everyone, I'm Dan Alquist, pastor of Westview Presbyterian Church in Longmont, Colorado, and I am looking forward to being with you all in October for Love, Longing, Sex, and Shadow in the Two Halves of Life. In our weekend together, it's going to be an adventure. It's going to be an adventure because we're going to dive into what Carl Jung called the shadow. And the shadow is not what we know about ourselves, but try and keep hidden from others. It's more mysterious than that. The shadow is what is true about us. What is true about us in good ways and in not so good ways. In fact, it's so good or not so good. The ego doesn't deem itself worthy of either one of those, and so we press it down into the deeper recesses of the unconscious mind. Uh, but it is beautiful work to do. And the adventure of hunting down that shadow is what we're going to talk about. The golden shadow, the parts of us that are just so amazing, we actually project them upon others, and the parts of us that aren't so amazing. And it works in the first half of life and it works in the second half of life. And we're gonna talk about our love. We're gonna talk about our longing. Uh, we're actually gonna talk a little bit about sex and we're gonna talk about shadow. So I'm looking forward to October. You know, as men, we connect often at very superficial levels. Uh, we connect over cars, over sports, over cigars, craft beers, or bourbons, over politics. Um, but it's rare that we let our guards down enough to, to meet each other at a deeper level. At a retreat like this, you'll have the opportunity to make real connections with real people about real topics. Um, I found it to be a wonderful experience, and I hope you will too. I look forward to meeting you. It's a well thought out event um, with inspiring leadership, a broad participation, so people of any age or backgrounds um, can really relate to this group. Um, and there's a lot more fun and friendship than you might guess, you know, on an, on an event like this. Really good accommodations at a beautiful outdoor setting. Um, so if you're sitting on the fence, you know, wondering like I was, you know, whether to, uh, you know, to, to dive in and, and, and consider this, um, what do you have to lose? You know, I would uh, strongly encourage you to consider this and, and join us. You'll have a blast. It's, a, it's an event where you feel challenged, but in a good way. and You feel like you come out of it renewed. You definitely come out renewed and ready to take on not just the whole week, but almost the whole year. I've been involved in men's ministries since my 20s in a number of different churches and contexts. And it's really been one of the most important parts of my faith journey. It's a great thing for guys of, of different ages to get together and to get to know each other a little bit, to share some of our joys and some of our struggles, some of our wisdom, some of our experience, and to help each other along the way. So I hope that I get to see you at the retreat this fall, and I also hope that sometime soon you get a chance on a beautiful day like today to get outside and enjoy God's creation. So I hope we've piqued your interest, and I hope you'll take this step. If you find yourself nibbling around the edges of yes, let me just share from my own life those moments when I said yes to something I wasn't completely sure about, but my heart was drawing me towards. Those moments have changed my life for the better. I know it's hard, I know we're asking a lot, but this retreat will be a game changer and it will bless the rest of your life, including all the relationships that matter most to you. I look forward to being with you and growing in faith together. Thank you.